Hello viewers, today we're going to be replacing the hard drive in a 2012 uh, 15-inch MacBook Pro computer. You have to excuse the clutter on the bench today, I have several other projects that are going on. Anyways, um, these are one of the last uh, models they made that uh, allowed it to be relatively easy to replace the drive. And um, I'm going to go through here and show that process in a few minutes. I'm going to be replacing it. Uh, it's got a 512 or something like that um, spinning drive, probably 7200. Um, we're going to replace it with a Samsung uh, drive. And these are very good. They're very highly rated drives. So um, the beginning of the process here is going to be to undo these four screws on the back. And I've I forgot to fetch my uh, screw holder. This is a um, something that I use. I should use it more often. Um, it's a magnetic board and it's very useful because you can put the screws on here in the same um, orientation <clears throat> that um, they came off the computer. So I'm going to uh, remove the screws now and then we'll put the drive in. Okay, so now all the screws have been removed and I'm just gonna pull up the back plate off. It doesn't seem to wanna come here. Okay, so as you can see these are fairly serviceable especially compared to the ones they make today. We have the battery um, which is not the easiest thing to change but you can in fact change it. Um, and then here is the hard drive which is what we're going to be interested for now. Let um, me zoom this in so you can see more carefully what's going on. And that doesn't really help. Let's see here. Okay, so the hard drive comes out. Um, you have to remove this bar up here at the top. And now we can lift the drive up and pull it out. Now this is going to be attached by a cable so you have to pull that off. Um, and uh, so here's the old drive. This is a um, HGST, whatever that is. Um, don't see if it says uh, what speed it is. I don't know. Well anyways that's not uh, very important. So this is the new drive. I'll open this up here and uh, it installs pretty much the same way so this is the old drive. I, it's very in, uh, it's impressive how lightweight these things are, it can't be more than a couple of ounces um, there is uh, some parts that we need off the old drive it has these, um, whatever these things are um, these have an odd uh, size bit to them which is kind of annoying so let me see if I can get one that's going to be the right size okay. so I'm going to remove these four things from the side And then we're going to have to install these on the new drive. Hopefully they uh, fit. Okay. Oh, I didn't realize that was zoomed in so much. Okay. Um, 
So here we go. We should be able to just screw these into the side here. Just like that. Okay, so that works uh that works fine. Okay, so now I'll zoom this back in. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, make the connection here. So I'll plug this in. And there's two holes right there where um, the drive rests in. So I'm going to insert those things that we just screwed onto there. I don't know what they're called. I'm going to insert those things into the holes. And then this will sit down. There's um, two little areas for it to rest up at the top. And then I will put the uh, the bar back in place to to lock it in. Let's go back to my other bit because these um, these screws are standard screws. Okay, so that is um, that is it really. Um, I'm also going to go around and and um, clean out the fans with um, the compressed air because you can see that there's quite a bit of accumulation in there and um, if you look from this angle you'll also notice that it's um, pretty much fully blocked right there so we're definitely going to want to clean that out um, but anyways that's uh, that's the procedure it's relatively simple um, It's pretty easy to put this cover back on as well. Most of the screws are the same. The only difference is the top right um, has three longer screws. Um, otherwise, they're all the same. So that's going to be it for this video. Thank you for watching. Comment, subscribe, and out.